And police in Mombasa have shot and killed two robbery suspects who were on a stealing mission at Brazil area Likoni. One suspect is said to have escaped during the Friday night incident. In a separate incident, two suspected gangsters were arrested at Mulaleo Estate after cutting a man with a machete in his bedroom. Francis Mtalaki reports. Through this CCTV footage, two men say to be members of a notorious gun are seen trying to break into a shop whose owners specializes in selling drinking water at Brazil area Likoni constituency. Unknown to them, the owner of the shop was a police officer. Armed with his scorpion rifle, he gave chase, gunning down two of the suspects. One of the suspects escaped with bullet wounds. A police reporter at Shelly Beach Station showed that the officer dispensed 20 rounds. <laughs> Tens of miles away at Mlaleo Estate in Nyali constituency, residents were battling with two suspects who are said to have made their way into and cut a man with a machete in his bedroom. Na kumukata kwa nyumba yake? Kwa kitanda. Kwa kitanda. Ambapo hatuta kubali. Iyo ni onyo natoa. Hatuta kubali. Hata wale walikuwa nano mechificha. Hawana hawan pati. Hawana pati. Ni lazima watopatikana. Ni lazima. His distress call alerting neighbors who laid siege on the assailants. <laughs> Angry residents were keen to administer mob justice. Their intent, however, disrupted with the arrival of officers from Yali Police Station. <laughs> We shall not agree that. Atuta kupaliana na iyo. Inatupasa tuwe tuinashikana, tuwe kitu kimoja. And I'm very happy, polisi wamekua... Responding, very, we may respond haraka sana. Nyali sub-county police commander Daniel Masaba called on Mombasa residents to assist security officers with any information that may lead to the arrest of criminal gang members who have been causing sleepless nights to the residents. He says his officers will intensify operations to flush out the gang members. Kwanza sana sana na shukuru wa nainji wa uku. Na mshukuru sana sana. Kwa sababu nasema hivyo, Yao vijana kama si juhudi zenu atunge pata. Tumshukuru kwa information na mshukuru pia kwa cooperation yenu pamoja na security agents. So, kitu ambacho nimefurahia ni kwamba the quick response ya na squeeze kwa sababu ya mitandao. Hii quick response ime ime yani habari imetembea haraka sana because hata walipofanya after 1 2 hours they are required to patikan. The latest incidents have seen residents demand more patrols, especially at night. During 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. curfew period, they say is providing safe haven for criminals. Francis M. Tlaki, Citizen TV.